Right, so let's try, shall we? So uh, last time we talked about um, you need to apply these changes, or uh, yep, something bad might happen because um, you might get a pretty weird um, coordinate system. Okay, so let's try it. Okay, so uh, the philosophy here is that um, I I like to you guys to um, yeah, just to play around in Blender. Okay, so um, as you guys can see, we got a Blender. Uh, let's make a diamond or let's make a sphere. Okay, so. Um, if you choose it, you just click it, choose it. Let, let me just open this the screencast so you guys can see what I got, what, 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 what's going on here. Okay, so let me make that a little bigger. Okay, and the mouse size is definitely the bigger. Yeah, that's that's pretty good. Okay, so uh, once you click it, and um, you can just uh, because you you know I'm I want to uh, make a sphere here. So um, um, first, uh, I'm going to leave that a little bit. So N, and um, once you um, are in this uh, object mode, um, yeah, you can just choose it, and you can leave that a little bit. So um, you can just uh, add the uh, dead axis location up, okay? Or you can just uh, input a certain number. So for example, if you want to leave it just that one, you just leave it up. Okay, so it's a uh, it's just uh, above the ground, and um, yeah, and um, so if I uh, want to change that to uh, a diamond, I'm going to uh, make that um, yeah, make that uh, change a little bit. So um, I'm going to add a rotation. So rotation, if I just uh, click and move my mouse left and right, you can just uh, rotate this object, okay? So, um, for example, if I just uh, enter the uh, 45, yeah, got this. Okay, so this is a pretty good shape. And um, if, here, yeah, it's a pretty important part. So if you don't apply these changes, if you don't apply changes, and you like to, uh, for example, you want to um, um, uh, scale the X, want to extend X so if you just add the scale of X you will notice that um, uh, what you think is that you will scale this way but in fact it's scaled this way okay that is clearly not the right way to do so I'm using on um, control plus Z to um, just to uh, just get rid of uh, everything like down and um, you're going to apply these changes so um, as I said earlier, um, you need to apply this rotation, okay, to reduce the rotation back to zero, um, so uh, back to default. So um, essentially, you, you want um, the uh, Blender to think that this um, object is at the original um, places rather than you have rotated it, and you can uh, further play around with it. So yeah, 